The Stonewall Jackson and Robert E. Lee Monument, often referred to simply as the Jackson and Lee Monument or Lee and Jackson Monument, was a double equestrian statue of Stonewall Jackson and Robert E. Lee, formerly located on the west side of the Wyman Park Dell in Charles Village in Baltimore, Maryland, alongside a forested hill, similar to the topography of Chancellorsville, Virginia, where Stonewall Jackson and Robert E. Lee met before the Battle of Chancellorsville in 1863. The statue was removed on August 16, 2017, on the order of Baltimore City Council, but the base still remains. The present location of the monument is unknown and some city council members called for all Confederate monuments to be destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> Significance The Jackson and Lee Monument was the first double equestrian statue in the United States. Artist Laura Garden Fraser was the only woman sculptor selected out of five other men to create the monument. Notable architect John Russell Pope was commissioned to design the base of the monument. <laughs> <laughs> Background Funding for the statue was secured by Colonial Trust Company owner J. Henry Ferguson before he died in 1928. Ferguson provided $100,000 for the erection of the monument. It was dedicated in 1948 in a ceremony at which Governor William Preston Lane Jr. and Mayor Thomas D'Alessandro Jr. spoke. The monument was located on the west side of the Wyman Park Dell along Art Museum Drive from its dedication until its removal by the Baltimore City government. Removal After the 2015 Charleston Church shooting, Mayor Stephanie Rawlings Blake organized a commission to evaluate removal of the city's four Confederate monuments. In January 2016, the commission decided that the Jackson and Lee Monument, along with William Henry Reinhardt's Roger B. Taney sculpture in Mount Vernon Place would be removed. On August 15, 2017, Baltimore City Council voted unanimously to deconstruct these monuments. The Jackson and Lee statue was subsequently removed by Whiting Turner Construction on August 16, 2017, but the base remains intact. Activists replaced the monument with a rendition of a pregnant African-American woman, created by artist Pablo Macchioli, was destroyed shortly thereafter. The pedestal was also repeatedly vandalized with politically motivated graffiti. <laughs> Inscription The base of the sculpture featured the following inscription. See also List of monuments and memorials of the Confederate States of America List of public art in Baltimore New Orleans Confederate Monuments Removal Removal of Confederate Monuments and Memorials Roger B. Taney Sculpture <laughs>